From aquatic plants to tropical fish, alligator farms to farm-raised clams, Florida's aquaculture industry is unique and constantly evolving. While it is big business today, the key to its continued success is in preparing its next generation of leaders. Achieving that success by stimulating student interest, endorsing aquaculture education, and promoting aquaculture management is the goal of the Florida FFA's Aquaculture Career Development Event, the Aquaculture CDE. Hosted by the University of Florida Institute of Food and Agricultural Sciences Tropical Aquaculture Laboratory, the Aquaculture CDE is an annual statewide competition for middle and high school students. This two-phase event is designed to test the students' understanding of aquaculture concepts through a series of general knowledge, identification, and problem-solving practicums. The first phase of the competition begins on spring CDE preliminary testing day, when teams from across Florida participate in a written exam composed of 50 aquaculture-based questions. From those schools, the top 10 middle schools and top 10 high schools advance to the second phase of the competition, the Aquaculture CDE Finals. Held annually at the University of Florida's Tropical Aquaculture Laboratory in Ruskin, Florida, the CDE Finals are a series of challenges that include a written exam, individual practicums, and a team activity. Each of the 20 qualifying schools sends a three to four person team to compete for top honors. The students are evaluated on their individual scores, while the top three highest scoring team members make up the overall team score. The students begin the competition by rotating through four stations, each featuring a different practicum. In the knowledge practicum, students take another aquaculture-based written exam. At the identification practicum, competitors are asked to identify 25 specimens from Florida's aquaculture industry and are expected to know their common and scientific names. High schoolers also need to know the environment and importance of each specimen. The teams are tested on these first two practicums every year. The two problem-solving practicums rotate between even and odd years. During even years, students are tested on water quality analysis and ID and treatment of disease, pests, and predators. During odd years, the practicums feature questions on the anatomy and physiology of aquaculture specimens, as well as aquatic system design and troubleshooting. While lunch should be a time to relax from the morning challenges, teams often spend the time rehearsing for the afternoon's portion of the competition, the team activity an oral presentation that accounts for almost a quarter of the overall team score. Here, students have an opportunity to demonstrate applied knowledge of aquaculture principles in a team environment. Two weeks before the CDE, each team is provided a scenario related to the aquaculture industry. Topics range from education to marketing, best management practices to biosecurity, or anything in between, and teams must develop an oral presentation that elaborates upon or solves that scenario. Your state champion aquaculture team is the Randall Middle FFA chapter. The results of the aquaculture CDE are finalized and posted a few days after the event. The awards for the top five teams, as well as the highest scoring middle school and high school individuals, are officially presented at the annual state FFA convention and expo. The Aquaculture Career Development Event is an exciting time for students, instructors, and FFA advisors. But more than entertaining, the CDE is instructional and informative. Students are presented with unique challenges that encourage them to think on their own and as part of a team. It opens their eyes to the possibilities of a career in aquatics, and in doing so, prepares the next generation of leaders in Florida's aquaculture industry. If you would like to learn more about the Aquaculture Career Development Event, contact your local FFA chapter or visit flaffa.org.